guys, we're back with another video for the Rattan LF750 Pro and the LM750 Pro. Today we're going to work on the program that raises the speed, lowers the speed, and also can set the PAS levels in between each PAS level to a different value. So let's say your PAS1 is at 13 miles an hour and you only want it to go 10 miles an hour. There are settings for that. And suppose you want the PAS levels to be more consistent from PAS level to PAS level. We're going to get into that today and let's see how it works out for us. So let's get started. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to copy these numbers down. First, you're going to want to go through them, videotape them or photograph them so you have a copy of what the original numbers and values are. And then if something happens and you say, oh, I want it to go back, or you want to sell your bike, or you want to do something else with your bike, uh, you have the original numbers to go back to. All right, let's get started. All right, guys, we're going to step up to the bike. We're going to turn the key on. Now we're going to come over and press the center, or press the, the center button to get it started. Now you can see the display comes up. I'm going to tip the display uh, just to help us out with while we're doing this. Let's set it up a little better. There we go. That's better for us here, I think. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to push the up and down button at the same time and hold it. Now, I'll be talking, so these may change. So the first one, uh, we know what that is. That's to change the brightness of your display. The second one is miles or kilometers. See, miles, kilometers. We're going to stick with the miles. The third one is the battery voltage. The fourth one is your magnets. And the fifth one, this is the one we want to deal with, PO5. PO5 is set at 5 right now. That's just telling you what we're doing. Now we're going to push the bottom button and hold it. And now we come into these P settings. P is just 41. We're going to leave that. So we're going to hit the bottom button again. And now we're at the highest P. So we're dealing with five levels of, of uh, PAS levels right now, not nine or three. Uh, or if I hit the up button, we're going to come back to that. So we'll hit the up button and we'll start at one. So here's one. I've only got five going today, but you can have nine or you can have three. But on our first one, you see it says 140. I'm going to hit my middle button now, and now 140 is blinking, and I'm going to lower this to, to 100. And what this is going to do, and hit them one at a time, don't hold it because it'll take you out of the settings. So this is PAS1, and we're going to move it to 100. This is just for me. You can make it whatever you want. And then we're going to hit the middle button again, and now we're back to 1. And now we're going to go hit the up button. Now we're at 2. It's at 166. I'm thinking that's 16.6 miles an hour. I'm going to, oops, sorry. I'm going to hit that again. Now I'm going to hit the middle button. And that moves us to make that blink. And now I'm going to lower that to 145, which is 14.5 miles an hour. And there we have it. And now I'm going to hit the center button again. That moves us to, to the P2. Now I'm going to hit up again. Now we're at 3. On 3, it says 191. I think that is 19.1 miles an hour. We'll hit the button. We will come down. And we're going to take that to 18.5 because that's 18 and a half miles an hour. So if you notice, my separations are 4 and a half. So now I'm going to hit the middle button again. That brings us to three. I'm going to bring my fourth one here. Now this says 21.7. For me, uh, 18 and four is 22. I think I got this, oops, my bad. I'm going to bring this back where we were. Uh, 217. I think I'm going to take mine to 235 or 230. Two thirty is twenty three eighteen and a half to twenty. Okay, so close enough. Now my last one, I'm going to hit. I'm going to hit that again. Now we're going to go up to P five. It says two fifty three. 
Now I'm going to hit the middle button again. Now we're flashing here. I'm going to take this to twenty-five five. That's as high a number as it can go. So twenty-five and a half miles an hour. So if you lower this. You can take it to 25 or you can bring it all the way back up to 25.5. Now I think I'm going to change my four a little bit different because I think that's too close to my 25. So I think I'm going to just move this one here down to about 21. Let's say 21 and a half. And there we have it. Now all you have to do is push the up and down button. That will set these. And now we're out of it. Now what you want to do is just push them again. The up, down. Now there's PO5. Oh, and here's what I can show you here. This is three gear or three PAS levels, five PAS levels, and nine PAS levels. I just want five. So, so there we are. I'm going to hit the down button and hold it. 41. 41. 100. 145. 185. 215. And 225. So yes, I did make that correct uh, doing uh, of, of changing the numbers. Now we're just going to hit this plus minus again to get out. And now we've completed the change for changing your speed either higher or lower and all you're doing is changing those numbers to what you want the speed to be so your first two digits are kind of your top speed might be 085 so that's eight and a half so just use the just take out the decimal and that's what your speed's going to be all right guys i hope this helped uh good luck uh, play with the numbers yourself. In this video, I'll put what I have kind of in mind, and, uh, and I'll put the originals at the end of the video too, so you have those. All right, guys, take care. Thanks a lot, and have a great day. That's the video for the day. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share, and subscribe below, and we'll see you on the next episode.